Um, I'm going to show you how to record your books, um, the recordable books, storybooks. You can get them at several different places. This one is from Hallmark. You can see it has a removable sleeve that you can pull off. They're about $30. You can get them on sale or with a coupon. Um, they have several different types. This one's called All the Ways I Love You. It's a very easy read for a smaller child by Hallmark. This one is My Grandpa and Me. It is also by Hallmark. Um, and then the Twas the Night Before Christmas ones are by Publications International. I love that they all have 3A batteries so you can change them out. So you can read the instructions, but basically what you do is you unscrew the, the recording compartment with a little screwdriver. The tip of a big one can work too. And you pull it off. I can get it. There we go. There's a little switch. Lock to unlock. Now, what I've done is I had somebody different read each page. So, all the ways I love you. That's my dad. A gift. I love you quicker than a minute. And that's my mom. I love you longer than an hour. I love you like the honeybee. My dad. Loves buzzing around. I love when you are this quiet. This is their great grandma. Oh wait, this is uh, my stepmom. Sorry. How did I skip one? Anyway, I've got their great-grandmother, my dad, my stepmom, and my mom. And I'm going to record one. Um, I will show you how to do this one. So basically there's a record button and a stop button. And you want to make sure that you are close to the microphone as you can be because some of them don't pick up as well. These Hallmark ones pick up a little bit better than the other ones. But... um. So you just hit the record button, and when you're done, you stop. But make sure there's no sounds in your house, like ice clanging or people in the background, because it makes it distracting and hard to hear. So this is just how you do it. You push the record button, and it will tell you what to do. To record, move switch to unlock position. Oh, see, I've got it in the lock position. It won't let you record over it. So that's wonderful. I had it. I traveled, in, and I didn't want it to record while I was traveling, so I put it in the lock position until I was ready to record mine. So you push, um, undo the ba batteries, put it in the unlock position, and then you hit it and it will tell you what to do. Begin reading after the tone. Press stop when finished. I love you, too, when raindrops fall, one by one, by one. I love you, too, when raindrops fall, one by one, by one. And if you like that, you can leave it and put it back in the lock position or go to the next page. If you don't like it, you just hit record again. Like this, because I didn't like the way that sounded. I'll do it again. Begin reading after the tone. Press stop when finished. I love you too when raindrops fall. One by one by one. I love you too when raindrops fall. One by one by one. Okay. And then as you, when you finish it and you like what you're, you've done, then you just put it in the lock position, screw the thing back on, and um, they can read it over and over. It was really cute. I had my mom do hers at one party, and my little grandniece, um, who's two, picked it up, heard the voices, recognized Grandma's voice, and got this cute little look on her face and just sat enthralled reading the books. Um, so it was re it's really a cute idea for your smaller grandkids. This is this one I'm going to actually record, put on YouTube for um, all of my grand my father and mother have eight children and 57, 58, something like that grandkids, not including steps, just in those those their kids and their children, and I don't know how many with steps. Um, she's had five or six kids, and they all have quite a few kids. So there's a lot of us. Anyway, I recorded my dad and mom and, and their mom and my stepmom. I love her. We don't <laughs> – she's just wonderful. So we – and her mother. Anyway, so I had them read a different page each, and I'm going to record it and put it on YouTube and then send a link for Christmas to all the grandchildren. And I, and I like this one because it has sound effects. Whereas the other two, my grandpa and me, and the other one that I have, don't have the sound effects, which is kind of fun for the kids as they turn the pages. So anyway, you can see how that, how fun that is. I know there's a glare, but anyway, and then um, I took pictures of them while they were recording this, 
And I love that in the back of this one, it has a slot for a picture. And I did take a picture of my father reading it. Um, and I'm going to put that in the back. And I also, what I'm going to do is put a little picture um, of each one of them in reading it in the back. I'm going to do a little, like a card with all of them. I took pictures of each of them and either put it in the front or put it in the back so that they have a picture. They can say, oh, who's that? Grandma, great grandma, that kind of thing. So I thought that was kind of a fun idea for a Christmas gift for your grandchildren. So I will post this and you can look at more of this um, type of idea on my blog, thesecretisgratitude.com.